Leading, hosting, or apprenticing in a life group is one of the best ways to allow God to use your life to impact others. At South Bay Church, we encourage everyone to consider turning their existing relationships, talents, interests, and hobbies into intentional small group environments that help people grow spiritually, connect in friendships, and serve others. Just pick a topic or interest that you are passionate about and use it as a way to help others grow in their faith. Hi, my name is Pablo and I recently co-led the life group based on the book uh, Wild at Heart by John Eldridge. Hey guys, my name is Jerry and I'm the leader of the entrepreneurship group here at South Bay Church. Hi, I'm Todd. I'm the uh, team leader for service and compassion life groups here at South Bay Church. Hi, my name is Stephanie and I was an apprentice for one of the young professional life groups this past spring. The leaders here, they allow you to take whatever you're passionate about, uh, whatever you're gifted in, and turn that into a life group. For me, um, that was entrepreneurship and leadership. I uh, chose that book because at a very difficult moment in my life, God used it to restore it, to literally change my life. So I thought that uh, he could do the same thing for other men. And um, so what I thought is, why wait for someone else to do it? Last fall, my wife and I stepped up uh, to lead a new life group that hadn't ever happened here at South Bay before. Uh, we had been on a missions trip to Ethiopia, and when we were coming back, we thought that there might be other people here at South Bay who had a heart for missions, who wanted to learn more and to experience or explore what that concept would be. So we decided to start a life group. Before I decided to apprentice, I was kind of scared and fearful and felt inadequate in doing so, but after praying and taking a step out in faith, I was really glad that I did. What I found out is that it is more, much more about availability than ability. Um, I wasn't sure about leading the group at the first, but then I just, you know, I just prayed about it. I just decided to let God do His thing. To be able to use those type of talents uh, here at South Bay has been really awesome. Uh, when we've really seen the group grow uh, from just a few people to meetings where we've had over 100 people. It was great. We had lots of new people that we had never met before and had never been on a missions trip before that were interested in seeing how. Uh, what it meant to serve outside of the borders of this country. We had an amazing group. We, we built really, really good friendships. Not only did I get to see other people's lives change, I got to see how my heart and my life changed as well. And I also got to meet people who are probably going to be lifelong friends. So if you're interested at all in leading a life group, I'd really encourage you to speak to one of the life group coordinators and you can turn one, any of your gifts or talents into a life group. Um, I just want to encourage you to pray and just do it anyways because if I can lead, you can lead too. I would encourage anyone to, to try out an experiment to see what happens when, when we step out in faith and God steps in.